coronavirus pandemic has had on Northeast Missouri businesses. Good evening. I'm Dylan Austin. McKenzie has the night off today. Local business leaders, uh, business owners and not for profits gathered the Marion County Courthouse to share what they think could be done differently to address situations like the pandemic in the future. WGEM's Frank Healy is in the newsroom tonight with more on what was to uh, discuss today. Frank. Dylan, a big point of the discussion was the impact on businesses in Hannibal, but local economic development officials say they got to hear from other groups as well that they hadn't heard as much from today. It was important for us to be involved today just to have a voice for our businesses. Hannibal Area Chamber of Commerce Executive Director Mackenzie Disselhorst was one of many at the meeting today. She says one of the biggest impacts for local businesses that could be improved upon in the future is help getting online services set up. I want to make sure that the businesses are able to adapt to that technology and have not only the funding they need, but the broadband, the infrastructure, you know, within our community. Stephanie Cooper, Douglas Community Services CEO, says she felt it was important their organization participated as well. Today's meeting, the reason that Douglas came was that we wanted to really talk about the impact that not-for-profits in the community have had during the pandemic. She says as the services Douglas provided doubled, she was glad to collaborate with other local organizations and government agencies to serve those people, and she hopes that continues. I think having those relationships and ensuring that even after the pandemic is over, that we're continuing to talk to each other and find out what our community needs and making sure that we can adapt to meet those needs. Hannibal Regional Economic Development Council Executive Director Corey Mahaffey says they were glad for all the input, and we're glad to hear from others at the meeting as well. Most of those for retail businesses, restaurants, those types of things. So it was interesting to hear more about the ag side of that. We didn't work with a lot of the farmers. And so, you know, we learned a little bit more about some of that tonight. And Mahaffey says that they plan to have another one of these meetings in Marion County early next year. In the newsroom, Frank Healy, WGEM News.